with regards to the summit, the first one I attended was as a fellow five years ago. So it's still in somewhat of a nascent form. And I give all the credit in the world to Johnny for how he's built it up. And some of the changes I've seen is just not only the breadth of topics, but the depth and some of the just heavy hitters in the in the science realm who are here. It's been nothing short of incredible um, to have some of the greatest minds in our area scientifically who are here to present. Some of the work here truly impacts how we translate that to our clinical practice and use that for better outcomes in the patients we see. And what I would expect from it in the future is that we continue at the Stephen Philippon Research Institute to be one of the leaders in the world for regenerative sports medicine um, and some of the basic uh, bioengineering processes that go into better understanding the problems we see and how we treat patients in light of a pandemic. I, I think we, we're fortunate to live in a place where we're, uh, it's an overall quite healthy population. One of the other silver linings for me has been the rise of telehealth. I think that the COVID uh, pandemic has really pushed that to the forefront. And I've embraced that. And so, for example, my clinic a couple of days ago, I did telehealth visits with somebody from Alaska, somebody from Maine, somebody from Oregon. And so I think our touch points and our, uh, our accessibility to those patients has never been better. It's just truly an honor um, and a pleasure to be here.